like all of us at the beginning of the pandemic, Montana native Matthew Warnick was trying to figure out what to do with all this extra time. That's when the idea of 50 dates in 50 states was born, which all started out virtually, but then he made it his mission to take them out in person and just finished his 50th date right here in the Treasure State. My date and I There's had a right rock answer. skipping Frozen competition. Lemonade. I had that plan from the very beginning. Most people were like, are you going to finish in Hawaii? Because Hawaii is like paradise, you know? And I'm like, you know what? Montana's paradise. Montana is home state. I think it'd just be cool to see me come back home, wrap around there, and make it the 50th state. The journey back home took more than five and a half months, tacking on more than 30,000 miles in his personalized 50 dates, 50 states pickup. He documented every single date on TikTok, building a following of more than 300,000 people and 10 million likes. That's been one of the coolest things about this whole journey is seeing fans throughout the whole U.S. When I'm driving, people will be honking or they'll film or they'll take pictures, which is really cool because at the end of the day, the core reason I started this whole journey is because I just like to make people smile. Montana State grad Cece Paharic was the lucky lady for date number 50, and to celebrate the big finale, the two of them had quite the day in Big Sky Country. We decided to go zip lining. We we went horseback riding, which I got bucked off. I literally fell for her. We came here to this brewery, and then we're gonna have a nice photography session later. It felt really special. We gotta save the best for last. We had a really good time. And as fun as it was to go on 50 dates with 50 different women, he says the real prize were the lessons learned along the way. I think the two biggest things I've learned on this journey is one, that the smallest idea can blossom into something amazing and spectacular. And the other thing I've learned through traveling throughout the whole U.S. is that we're all really not so different. It's really cool just to see that common ground between the whole U.S. Now, Matthew doesn't know what's next for 50 dates in 50 states, but he's just going to take these next couple months, enjoy them at home, and then head back to the drawing board. Reporting in Bozeman, Ashley Washburn, MTN News.